again, but it's night market time, yes. A new and exciting edition of the Agri Night Market has now been added, the Music Festival Edition. Listen, this Agri Night Market in every season, huh? <laughs> so this morning we have Delwyn Delaney, Senior Business Advisor at the Small Business Development Center, and Chiara Flanders, Head of the Media and Media Unit Department of head of the media unit of the Department of Agriculture. They join us this morning to discuss the upcoming night market. So welcome back to both of you. Thank Next you. set of celebrities we have on this morning. Thank you for having us. Thank you for having us again. So yes. tell us about the collaboration with the Music Festival Committee. Okay, so yes, obviously this edition of the night market is the music festival edition and like you rightfully said it seems like the night markets have their own themes in different seasons yeah. and so yes now that the event is a monthly event we've decided that duh june has to be <laughs> <laughs> the music festival edition of the night market nice. and of course the music festival committee they were very happy to partner with us mm -hmm. and nice. this time around we actually allowed small business development <laughs> to take the lead on this edition. So I'll let Delwyn tell you a little bit more about that. So Delwyn, how did your entity become involved? Yes, so I think it was the start of the year. Um, our minister um, decided that because we have the same minister, agriculture and small business, yes. and merge the two of them and, nice. you know, we have our nightly um, not nightly, sorry, monthly Market. night markets, agri night markets. Mm -hmm. And so we became a part, um, and it has been going good. The partnership has been forging a lot of um, produce, okay. right? Um, literal produce. <laughs> <laughs> literal. <laughs> literal. And so this this month, um, we wanted to spruce it up a bit, um, mm -hmm. albeit the, the month of June as colleague would have mentioned yeah. it's music festival month and we are days away from the music festival and this yeah. is almost like a precursor yeah. to the music festival um, come this Wednesday. Nice, yes. nice. Indeed. So how is preparation going so far? Listen, we have been trying our best to keep it together mm -hmm. because obviously we have other things that we do, of course, in the various ministries, mm -hmm. um, both Delvin and I, um, the Ministry of Small Business and Entrepreneurship which of course is the umbrella for small business development. Mm -hmm. And of course, for me, you know, we have a very large ministry, right. the Ministry of Agriculture, yes. Fisheries, Marine Resources, mm -hmm. and Cooperatives. But we have been doing really well as a team, trying to, you know, put work together the mm -hmm. boots are on the ground. Um, we are in, of course, the final stages of the preparation. Mm -hmm. And just, I think on Friday, we met with the representative from the promotion and marketing committee mm -hmm. um, for the music festival of course Ms. Williams and yes okay they, they have been um, working with us and I would say really working in a way that it's almost like they've been wanting to work with us mm -hmm. for quite some time, which is absolutely nice. amazing. Aww. And it makes it a bit easier for yes. us to plan and design and decorate and that sort of thing. So that is what we did. So we traveled to the Bastia Public Market and we got the opportunity to point out the different areas where we would like to, you know, have our flags and posters or banners. Okay, and nice. That sort of thing. So you will know that this is the music festival <laughs> of the like early night market right. yeah so you won't you won't you, you can't you can't miss it so i would say you folks have been on quite a bit with the night market has anyone from the diaspora contacted you with an interest to be part of this night market since it's a music festival edition and they may be coming home. Actually, now that you say that, I don't think we've had anyone contact us as yet. Okay. So thank you for that because now I have to add it to the list of things to question. Mm -hmm. Because I think a partnership would be great and maybe it would actually help us expand mm -hmm. the night market. And yeah. Maybe possibly even move the night market to a larger location. Yeah, because it's, it's going to get bigger. Mm -hmm. For all persons um, as well. Because of course, the, the, the public market is the designated location yes specifically because we want to promote the agricultural stakeholders the vendors the farmers the mm -hmm. fishers the small business owners um so maybe perhaps if we try to expand that 
perhaps might be able to work together with some sort of regional entity. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know if you know, but sometime last year, they had the Agri-Fest in mm. the USBI. Yeah. It's one of their major, yeah, one of cool. the major events that they have. And so maybe if we could get to turn our mm -hmm. Agri-Night market Shucks. into a... Into agri like yeah. yeah. Speak it into being in this. Hashtag goals. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dalvin, I see you shaking your head. Do you have something to yes, add? Uh, and perhaps not wanting to be of all the persons have reached out to us in, in relation mm -hmm. to being a part mm -hmm. but it is designed that once we you know we attract persons who oh. are here on oh, the ground that's sweet, yeah. right yes. to be a part and say hey you know to experience mm -hmm. this thing um some of the things that we are looking to do to draw persons in yes. we are hoping to have a few of the artists who are performing on the music festival to make some appearance yeah, you know i mean you gotta go to the, don't them. miss this night market yeah, right? you can't miss this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, you never know. You never know. Y'all hearing that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so if y'all don't go, y'all will definitely miss out. Yeah. yeah. Nice. So, and, and we have the karaoke competition, and mm -hmm. you know we have, uh, we yes. have lots of add-ons. So. Please let Delway know he can't just brush over the highlights. One of the the major highlights of this night market. Delvin, what are you brushing over? <laughs> he wants to rush over the competition. Yes, yes. <laughs> yes, yes, sorry. So yeah, uh, it's a carry your own key. Yes, yeah. carry your own key. key. Yes, carry come and carry it. Right. And so um, persons would have the opportunity to, to win uh, music festival tickets. Oh, nice. Right? Um, at the karaoke competition. Uh, for each night or for particular nights? Um, so it's one per night and okay, we have okay. different... different Got you. Um, Yes, we're going to opportunities. have raffles, oh, okay. raffles have right? various opportunities mm -hmm. to get the chance to win a music festival ticket. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's talk about the event date and time. Uh -huh. Yes, so today is Tuesday and the event is actually tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow, yes. Wednesday. So Wednesday the 21st is the Agri Night Market Music Festival Edition. Mm -hmm. And this is going to be held at the Bastia Public Market from 5 p.m until 10 p.m. Now I must say the last until time <laughs> we had the, the Agri-Fest version of the night market, we told the patrons at 5 to 10 p.m. and 11 o'clock St. Kitts people would not go home. <laughs> no, I, th that's why I just said 10. You know 10 is not going to work. It's, 10 is probably not going to work, but I mean, we don't discriminate. Yeah. The event was an event that was very, you know, just fun loving, mm. lots of excitement, lots of things to do, lots of things to eat. Yeah. I mean, we had seafood on the grill. The last night market that we had, we had barbecue rabbit. Mm. And trust and believe me, yeah, there was a crowd for the barbecue rabbit. I was very surprised. I have mm. not had the barbecue. Oh, rabbit you haven't tasted it? Okay. Yeah. So this okay. time. Yes. But oh, okay. We have had um, so many different types of local food, produce, I mean, the products. Delwyn, I mean, you could tell them some of the products that the small yeah. business owners have. So we have persons who will be selling um, candles, um, jewelry. We have persons who... Um, who does um, food, different food vendors. Mm -hmm. um, basically, you name it, they'll be there. Um, you got to go. Yeah. Um, presently, at our last registration, would have saw just over 30 small businesses. That's oh, just wow. small businesses so alone. Okay. And that's not to... to um, that include, include the, the food, the food, right. food, oh, wow. food vendors and the produce the vendors, yeah. right? So it's, wow. it's going to be packed in the um, come come tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, speaking on patrons, is there a target audience that you is specific to, or any is available to anyone to come out? Listen, I'm so happy that you asked that question mm -hmm. because the agri night market should be. A national thing, yeah. In the my family. honest opinion, yeah. family oriented. Yeah, I like that family. Yeah, I mean, we want everyone—brother, sister, uncle, cousin, friend, mm -hmm. colleague, children, grandparents. Exactly. <laughs> because we, we have added, um, we've just added our social areas. Oh, nice! Uh, in the night market, where we have persons can just we lo uh, lounge and perhaps play dominoes or chess oh, nice. or whatever the case yeah. is. Uh, we have persons who will be selling like treats, sweet treats, so for the kids, yes. whether popcorn and that sort of thing. So, okay. I mean, from the, the young and young at heart. Yes. So, so, so we're gonna have to take this road and that road. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Mm. I see what you did there. Yeah. Yes, we're gonna need the space. L literally. Take those we are, we are literally offering so much in 
an area that I mean just really focused on just fruit and vegetables. Yes. And so we're trying to incorporate all aspects of agriculture. You know, we had the guava cheese. Mm. Guava cheese is something that you may not necessarily get every day of the year. Right. But I'm so happy to see that our agro processors, they're making guava cheese, not just from guava anymore. Mm. Guava cheese is being made from salsa, mm. gooseberry. The so first time I had um, the, the salsa guava cheese, I was like, Wait, is it salsa guava mm. cheese still or is it salsa cheese? Like, salsa salsa cheese. <laughs> I was like, what? Yeah, I was like, okay, so it's not guava anymore. But it's, it's sour soft now, and it's amazing. It's very, very delicious. So okay. if you are a lover of, you know, those types of cheeses, the products are made from our local produce. And that is exactly what we want to encourage. We want our farmers, our fishers, our agricultural stakeholders, our small business vendors, those persons, even if you're coming to mm. sell popcorn and hot dog to the kids, yeah. at least you know that there is a space for you. And we want all persons all across St. Kitts and even in Nevis because we have the Nevis Abattoir Division also coming down. Oh, nice. So they'll be participating nice. again. Nice. Federation. Yes. The thing I like that. It was that. so amazing the last time they were here. They have returned and they're going to be selling their pork sausage, Italian pork sausage. They're going to be selling rotisserie chicken. I mean, roasted beef, pork, you name it. I mean, no, we like chicken and pork in St. Kitts. So wow. you know that you have to get your, you have to get your rotisserie chicken. Get they have your to rotisserie go rotisserie chicken early because they go fast. Indeed. Oh. And with that said, Shara, that's your camera right there. Tell the folks watching why they should come on out tomorrow for the festival. Listen. You need to be at the Agri Night Market tomorrow, Wednesday, 21st June, 2023, because I know that you don't have anything to do before the music festival, <laughs> Nothing. okay? Nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing more seconds more than, that. than coming to yeah. the Agri Night Market on Wednesday, 21st June. I would say you should probably use this as your music festival warm-up mm -hmm, yeah. so that when you go to the music festival, you say, okay. You're loose. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're already, <laughs> already because the night market gave me a little jam, a little food here and there. So you have no reason to miss it. You just don't have an excuse. And...